Hello, I'm Jerry Ford. I'm going to review a British product that was sent to me by Ed O'Brien. Um, <clears throat> so, my wife um, had remind, reminded me the other day of something I was trying to think of that these were similar to that we have in the States. Um, I haven't seen them in a while, I don't think. I think I, last time I saw them, there's that like a Cracker Barrel because it's kind of like a, they've been around a while. Uh, the moon pies, which are like <clears throat> they're round, they have two kind of a graham cracker, you know, circle, big cookie parts on the top and the bottom, and then on the and it's on in the inside it's got marshmallow, but it's covered with a chocolate um, kind of an icing. Um, maybe you could say syrup, but it's it's you know hard milk chocolate um, covering. So that's what these kind of look like from what I'm looking at here in the, on the package. Um, <clears throat> so I'm gonna kind of see if they're similar. Oh. That's interesting. It says six individually wrapped. I didn't even compute it, you know, that that's what that where it were individual. Um, it says biscuit filled with mallow and covered in chocolate flavored coating. Look good. <coughs> All right. Let's see. The the moon pies are bigger than this. They uh, a lot of the <coughs> um, people in the U.S. will will know what I'm talking about. They're like they're like a four by four um, round. Um, Somewhere around that. Around they're about that, th about that thick, about a uh, one and a half, close to two inches thick, somewhere around there maybe. <clears throat> so these are different looking than that, but they do. As I open this, they do look like a small version of that. Look kind of like a like a extra large. Thin mint or something. Yeah, it looks a lot like like the moon pies, only just smaller and thinner. Look good. I have a little bit of a have a milk chocolate plus a little bit of a um. I almost want to say a little bit of a dark chocolate aroma too. Smells like, like a, a little bit of like a little almond or something or a nutty within the chocolate. I don't know. Let's uh, thought I had a plastic knife. I don't. Let's just break it. Let's just break it in two. See how that goes. the thin marshmallow in there um, looks good it's got kind of a dark the moon pies wafer is white this is kind of has a wheat kind of a, a dark a little brownish colored um, cookie part biscuit part wafer. it's not really waferage I think a wafer like well it is kind of wafer like like a, well, kind of a like a graham cracker a little bit. Let's see.
Okay, the uh, <clears throat> you get the milk chocolate, you get the mallow. I still get that a little bit of a just a light, just a light dark chocolate, but it's kind of I'm getting that almond again a little bit, um, a little nuttiness. The 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 uh, the, the upper and bottom part. Instead of being graham crackerish kind of a texture, they're more of a cookie kind of a texturish texture. Um, <clears throat> I'm trying to remember if the moon pie was like that. I think it was more graham crackerish. This is a little thicker, a little bit harder um, texture. Um, It's good. Let's see if we can find some ingredients. Um, let's see. Chocolate flavor coating, sugar. <clears throat> Cocoa powder. Glucose syrup. Gelling agent. Palm oil. Cocoa powder and salt. Okay, well, I'm just not totally sure where I'm getting that little bit of an almond kind of taste. Chocolate flavored coating. Okay. So it's right there. Says because we care. No artificial colors. No artificial flavors. No artificial sweeteners. No artificial preser preservatives. And no GM ingredients. And no hydrogenated fats. Consumer Services, let's see, UK, Burton's Biscuit Company. Okay. These are good. Biscuit filled with mallow and covered in chocolate flavoring coating. Different. All right, well, I'm going to end it there. Thank y'all for watching. I appreciate it. Let me know if you tried these. And thank you, Ed, for sending me these to try. Pretty enjoyable. Thank y'all for watching. And we'll see you on the next one.